This morning, we're getting a look at all the damage that a brush fire caused this weekend. It burned hundreds of acres in Collier County. People have lost their homes and vehicles, and this morning, hot spots are still burning. Take a look at your screen. Want to show you where this is exactly. It's at the intersection of Wilson Boulevard and Immokalee Road, just east of Heritage Bay Country Club. The Forest Service says the fire spread north along Wilson Road. Fox Tours Alexandra Ron is live in Collier County this morning with what she's seeing after a weekend of firefighters trying to keep that fire from spreading any further. Chris, I just uh, spoke to the North Collier Fire District just a few minutes ago before coming on air. He tells me there is no active fire, but there is, there is still some hot spots, and you can actually see one behind me. Uh, we're going to try and zoom in. It's still a little dark, but you can see some of the flames there burning. It is small. This is off Wilson Boulevard, North and 24th Avenue. Now, the fire department says it will take a few days for some of these fire embers to cool down on their own. They are not a threat, but it's still very very much smells like smoke out here in this area. It's a very different scene from what it was on Friday. We were here when those evacuations were ordered for residents in the area. Officials tell us the cause of the fire was due to a power line that hit a tree. Now take a look at your screen. This is video from the Collier County Sheriff. They used a Vietnam era helicopter to scoop water out of canals and drop it on the fire right along Jung Boulevard. The fire spread across 300 acres. The damage is substantial with North Collier Fire District reporting two homes are a total loss. Three more have minor damage. Also, eight vehicles and four boats were damaged in this fire. Right now, Collier County is under a burn ban until further notice. This means no open burning of trash and yard waste. Now, if you do, you are facing a fine. Officials are also telling us for residents to upkeep their uh, yards and remove it from any flammable, flammable objects or any dry brush in the area to prevent um, some of these uh, fires that happen during the weekend. But we'll be here throughout the morning in Collier County and continue to bring you updates throughout the morning. Reporting live from Collier County, Alex. Sandra Angel, Fox 4.